Hey y'all, so welcome back to my channel. I want to first start off by apologizing and telling you guys that I'm so sorry for being MIA, but I promise y'all the next video I post today will be explaining why I've been absent again. Um, but this time it was just um, me taking time back for myself again because of something that happened. And I'm gonna go into detail with you guys in my next video. So please stay tuned for that if you wanna know what I've been doing and what I've been up to. And let's get right into it. So the video I'm gonna be doing is reviewing the ColourPop, um, ColourPop No Filter Sticks. I have been wanting these for so long. I've been got these like two weeks ago, but I just have not reviewed them yet. Like I said, I'm gonna update you guys on my next video today so make sure you keep stay tuned for two videos posted today so um let's just get right into this i have never used foundation sticks before so and i haven't watched any reviews yet either i think i tried watching one review but i didn't finish it um so i don't remember what primer they used or anything like that so i'm gonna just start off by using the Mario, the Mario Badescu um, Rose Water, just because I know it's probably gonna be drying. I'm sure it's gonna be drying because it's in a stick form. So I wanna make sure that my face is ready to handle all of this. It is the winter time as well. And in the Dallas area, it has been so cold recently over the last 48 hours. So you can imagine what my face looks like in person. So the colors that I have in the color stick, color pop foundation sticks, that's gonna throw me off this whole video. Um, I got two neutral tones because if you guys follow me for a while, you know I always say I'm mostly neutral than anything. Um, so I have medium dark 147 in, then I have dark 161 in. So I got both of these colors because I thought maybe I might have to mix them but I don't know yet, so I might be able to get away with one, but my luck, I'm probably gonna have to mix because I'm usually having to mix foundations anyway. So these are the colors right here, 147 in and 161 in. Okay, so let's go ahead and do, bring that down so I'm, do a swatch. Forty-seven in medium dark. Then this is one sixty-one. Both of these look like it is not my shade <laughs> at all whatsoever. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and just try to mix. I don't know what this gonna look like i only got two because i was kind of scared to get more than that because i wasn't for sure um i wasn't for sure what my color would be so that's probably way too much foundation but let's see i see i'm gonna have to go in with a kind of a stiff brush so let's see So far, I know this is not gonna be my color, but I'm gonna make this work, y'all. I'm literally gonna make this work if I can. This was my fear of getting makeup online is because you just never know if you're gonna look out and get your color and then have to go through shipping and all of that kind of stuff like shipping your products back or whatever. So, y'all know me, I'm finna make this work. Finna get this working. So I see I'm gonna use this color, 147, and around the parts of my face that I know I'm gonna add concealer. And to be honest, this really is not neutral. 
I see a lot of um, warm in here. So, I don't know, ghost right now. Let's see if we can make this work, first of all. <laughs> I'm saying we're gonna make this work and I have no idea if I am about to make this work. I'm definitely sending this back to ColourPop, but I do love the concept of it. I love ColourPop's products. It's just, I know I will not be wearing this foundation sticks anywhere. Like, even if I was to find my shade, this is not for me. <laughs> I don't know, foundation sticks, um, this is my first time trying it, but I just know I will not be liking it because... Like I said, I had to pull it all across my skin. Even applying it is, um, you know, having to pull it across my skin. So, don't like that. I'm just, I'm gonna try their foundation, their regular foundation that they came out with a while ago and um, see how I like that and see if I can find my shape. Now I'm gonna go in and fix my brows a little bit more and I'll come back and show you guys the rest and tell y'all my thoughts about these foundation sticks. Okay y'all, so this is the finished look. I hope you guys like it. I can say the foundation stick is really good for someone who really wants just like an on-the-go makeup, traveling. Um, you know, you might want something that's uh, really quick to travel with. Or also, it's not drying. I want to rephrase that. It's not drying, drying, but it is not for people like me who has really, really dry skin. So I am going to say that um, because I just don't like how it feels on my skin right now either. So um, even just, like I said, it's putting it on, um, blending it in, all of that. And it could be that I just didn't use enough moisturizer or maybe I needed a better um, moisturizing primer or whatever. Um, I'm not sure. I know they have the primer on their website that you can purchase, but to be honest with me, I don't like to put a whole, whole lot of stuff underneath my foundation just for the foundation to work right. To me, a foundation should work right because it works right, and the comp, the primer, and I think everything else should just, um, you know, like complement it or whatever. So, um, but I can say I really do like the formula of it. I just don't like how it feels on my skin. Um, I am going to send these back to ColourPop and I'm going to purchase the foundation sticks. Um, I know I've been talking about for a long time here on my channel is getting the ColourPop um, concealers. So I finally got those y'all and I am going to start using those here pretty soon. Um, be on the lookout because I am going to be reviewing some more ColourPop products. Because um, like I said, I really do love ColourPop. It's just that these foundation sticks did not do it for me. So I hope you guys like this look. Please stay tuned if you want to see what my next chapter is about to be about. Um, and I'm just so excited to share this news with you guys. And um, yeah, I'm going to do that today. And I'm going to have that posted today. So um, please guys go over to that video because I really want you guys to hear the really exciting news. And... Yeah, until next time, I love y'all and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.